Hello friends and today I am going to speak about the Scorpio woman. Wow, don't be scared. <laughs> well, before I start, please do subscribe to my channel if you like the content uh, so that every time I can disturb you. What is the Scorpio woman about? She's this most magnetic enigma of the zodiac for me very magnetic enigma you can never ignore a scorpio woman you can never ignore her she she makes her presence felt either with that discreet secretive presence of hers which she tries to hide so much in public otherwise the extravagant uh, you know presence of hers like she comes like a glamour diva in front of you otherwise that simply dressed yet those hypnotic eyes that follow everyone or that follow people uh, and make them completely uncomfortable under her glance this is a Scorpio woman this woman if you take a look at the Scorpio woman this lady I would say she is so dignified she's so dignified she has something in her um, that can make you just feel very uncomfortable at the beginning yeah if you're a man and if you are approaching the Scorpio lady be very careful yeah you you shouldn't try to flirt with her the first and the foremost thing is don't try to flirt with her because you know in the very first minute or second she will understand what's your intention in getting close to her don't try to flirt with her even if you're flirting with her after five minutes or so she will just she'll just tell you stop it if you cannot be somebody sincere don't even approach her you don't want to get burnt <laughs> don't even approach her or if you approach her tell her what you mean what's in your heart what is the truth you have to tell her because she needs to know the truth when you go and when you if you if you say a lie to her or something I mean she's an extreme machine she will scan you very nicely I mean before you have reached her only maybe she has already fathomed that okay this one is interested in me he's going to come to me and he is going to try to you know say some things to me yeah she she is very good at sensing things around her yet she is Yet she is so hypersensitive inside of her. She has tremendous emotions inside her heart and she gives it to the man she loves. And who does she love? Is a man who deserves her loyalty and devotion, not any other man. You flirt with her, she'll flirt with you and she'll leave you in a very bad shape. But if you are the man who is ready to give her all this love and this devotion, then this lady will live up. To your expectations but if you demean her if you get her into a kind of a state where she feels completely insulted and demeaned then she will leave you with a thousand stings in your body and heart and mind and soul when she stings she stings <laughs> you cannot escape it and then you are the most miserable poor creature on this earth that everybody will feel bad for you but then do you do you really deserve that that pity from everyone did you forget what you did to her hmm. for a Scorpio woman she means business okay she means business you cannot just be you know wishy-washy with her no 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 she means business because she is not clumsy she just knows what she wants and if she accepts you as her life partner my dear then she will invest and devote her time and energy and life in securing your future together even if you are somebody who is uh, not very well to do at the beginning okay you're you're struggling with your life but you have if she sees you have the capacities that is what attracts a Scorpio woman to a man also 
she will see the capacities in people she sees them she recognizes if you have the capacity if you have the ability then she will invest her life in you she will she will take a back seat in her own career even if she is very very successful in life she will just you know uh, come come back and she will she will take a back seat and she will let you be the boss no matter how individualistic or how independent the scorpio woman is she doesn't believe that she is the second best and the man is the first best she doesn't believe in that maybe deep inside of her she feels that she is better than a man and why not because she is she is she feels she can dive into this life and go through this life alone no matter what she has that power for her loneliness matters a lot also she's not afraid she's not afraid she's mentally she's very very strong because she has gone through lots in life okay usually the scorpio women they go through lots in life as i had said in my earlier scorpio video also in the childhood while growing up there is lot of things that they go through okay so she's gone lots through lots maybe some kind of traumas maybe some kind of accidents maybe some kind of insecurities also in her childhood but now she when she has grown up into a woman into a lady she is completely formed she knows what's her power this woman is powerful this woman is powerful now you will say why don't we understand the scorpio woman why is it so difficult sometimes to understand you know the way she behaves is a bit difficult because you have to know that she's extremely secretive also she's the best sign in all of the zodiacs to keep your secrets you go to your scorpio friend and tell her things it stays buried in her heart as if it was a cemetery that she buries all those secrets of all her friends who are so dutiful but if you but if you play games with her then she is going to use those secrets against you use it means she is just going to you know blast you with that because she trusts you and so you have to be trustworthy because she has trusted you and if you backstab her never do that with a scorpio lady never never do that because the bitterness of thousands of poisons will be poured on you ask her husband <laughs> or ask her partner who was not good with her who cheated on her or who was not right who was not behaving right she can become violent when she fights she can get to that extent first of all the words start like arrows you know i would not say arrows because that is more of the sagittarian uh, trait but here it is the sting you know it will come and start stinging you on all of your heart <laughs> and not just that that won't be sufficient and if you again try to convince her of your lies that you have lied to her and you try to convince to her that this was the truth most probably most probably she will have something and she'll hurl it at you she will hurl it at you stop it stop taking her for a ride stop taking her for granted and then you call her parents and say your daughter is behaving like this or you tell your friends that oh my god i got hurt on my head over here she hurled a stone on me or she hurled that paper block uh, you know uh, that paper weight that was on the table or or a kind of a, uh, <laughs> a show piece that was there you have hurled it yeah she has hurled it on you so they'll never believe you they say oh no she's not like that but yes she can be until you confess of your guilt and the lies that you have told to her while you're getting ready for all those wounds on your body most probably never mess with her my dear never never mess with her she is the woman she is a loyal woman if you have earned a scorpio in your life i would tell you my dear you have earned the most loyal woman she's very 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 loyal she's very honest i mean whatever is in her heart she will not sugarcoat it she will not sugarcoat it like other like other signs she will not sugarcoat it she will just say the truth very brutally and honestly on your face the truth is the truth and who said truth is sweet it's bitter 
to swallow and she will make you swallow that you have to but you will thank me my dear because she is honest and she is truthful she is very honest and she is very loyal fiercely loyal woman she is if she loves you, she will love you deeply. But if you don't recognize her love, if you don't recognize what she is doing for you, then that's it. She will throw you out. Excuse my, me for my language, but she will actually throw you out as if you were a garbage, not to be recycled again. How does that feel? Not good, no? But if you keep her happy, do you know this woman is made up of some material inside of her is very spiritual also. For her, love is like a religion for her, okay? So she can become fanatic for you. Overly possessive she can become. And mind you, she's suspicious. Mm. So if you come home, <laughs> if you come home or if you meet her and you have some hair on your coat <laughs> which is not belonging to her, yeah, or, <laughs> or if she smells a lady's perfume on you, mm, God save you, the hell is going to break loose on you, she will make out. If you give her a chance to be suspicious, she will probe into the depth. She might almost find out everything. She will put things around you. First of all, she will know because her intuition is very strong. This lady has those scorpionic eyes. She, she will x-ray in your eyes. She will ask you a question while you're having your lunch or dinner. You know, She'll just look at you and she'll just say, uh, so what's her name? And you'll be like, oh, what? Whose name? You know, you'll try to camouflage it. If you are the bad person in that story, if you're cheating on her. And she'll say, that perfume on your coat. And <laughs> you will feel a bit awkward. You will try to cover it, cover it, cover it. Mind you, if that's a hot soup, ooh, if it's cold, still you're saved, huh? Take care of that. Never lie to her. Never cheat her. Most of the Scorpio women, rather I would say majority of the Scorpio women, um, they end up alone in life. After the marriage also, many divorcees uh, are Scorpios. Uh, just because, you know, what happens is that in a couple, the, the thing is that you have to, you know, be a bit sweet, sugar-coated. That's not her that's not her at all that's not her at all she cannot be sweet sugar coating no if she's quiet also in a relationship inside she's suffering you have to know that that bitterness which sinks inside of her it makes her suffer a lot yeah even if she has to live in poverty with you you know she will not show it to you she will adjust but inside she's not happy she's unhappy she she feels like you know that she's been killed every day because she knows what is her uh, what is her capacity, what she can do. But just because you are the man, she's allowing you to be the boss. She's suffering in the back seat. She suffers. She will invest in your career also. She will always, you know, tell you, okay, do this, do that, you know. She will boost your confidence. She will try to motivate you to achieve what it takes for you to be the real winner, you know. And if you're not living up to that, my dear Scorpio, uh, my dear, then the Scorpio woman will send you some stings, time to time pokes, you know. Sarcasm will come your way. Because she's not happy. She feels, how, are, how is it possible? How can you give up so easily? She doesn't understand that. She just doesn't understand. She's very ambitious. And prestige is very important for a Scorpio woman. You cannot be just, uh, you know, lazy with her. No, you cannot be. Very important. Prestige is important. My husband has to have a name. My boyfriend has to be somebody special. And I am special. She knows her value. So she wants to cultivate those values in you also. So when you're Scorpio woman, 
is saying, why don't you aim for higher goals in life? Why don't you search for a better job? Why don't you do this? Don't feel that she's being, um, you know, very materialist. No, she's not. She's just trying to bring out the best in you because she knows your capacities. A Scorpio looks at you, knows your capacities. This is why she has chosen you, mister. She has chosen you as a partner, my dear. Otherwise, she wouldn't have chosen you. She saw something in you. She saw that spark in you that can brighten up her life. So this is why she's working on you now. And you have to give her a helping hand if you want to reach the, those levels in your career, in your life. She might fight with you in the public. Sorry, she might, f uh, she might defend, fight for you in the public. Excuse me. She will defend you in the public. Even if you're wrong, she'll fight for you. And in private, however, she will give you left and right. What was the need, she will say. What was the need to do that? She'll fight with you, but alone. This lady cleverly deals with you in her life. Cleverly in the sense, I'm using the cleverness which is positive over here, not negative, mind you. Her house. Once you are married to Scorpio or when you're living with a Scorpio woman, the house is clean and tidy. Everything is done on time. The meals are served on time. You sleep on time. Everything is quite well done. Provided you're keeping her happy, okay? Otherwise, she will be leaving the mess for you to clear up. With children, she will be quite... Uh, disciplining mother just like she is with you regarding your career she will also invest in their studies she will sit and take their studies if the child is not wanting still she will say okay perseverance is her next name we are going to persevere here she's going to say now my dear now you have to do your maths to solve those maths problems the child's, no, I don't want to do it. You will have to do it. I'm here. It's difficult. No, nothing is difficult. I'm here. Your mother is here. And come on now. We are going to repeat it. We are going to repeat it. We are going to repeat it till we get it right. This is the perseverance of the Scorpio mom. She's very protective. I would say a bit too much sometimes. Because she wants to shield her little one. She, she wants to protect her little one. Because she knows how is the outside world then. She wants to shield her little child. She wants to give a lot of love, joy to her. And she's very, very protective about the child. And she can also shield that child from you. If you are the undeserving father of those children. If she feels there is a threat to her child from someone, be it you, her partner, she will shield that child from you. She will take away the child from you because she feels you are not a responsible father. You are not a responsible father. You are not being a responsible partner here. You are not doing your fatherly duties. So what is your need in my life, she will say. If you can't do that, you have no right over me or my child. That's it. It calls for a divorce. It calls for a separation. Or it calls for complete seclusion or taking away the child from the father. Can be a bit difficult, you know, if you are um, a man who is a bit, you know, uh, not as passionate as her. Passion is her second nature. I would say her name. She's a passionate woman. She's a passionate woman. And not just passion when it comes to your bedroom life, but passionate in everything. She's full of passion. She doesn't do anything simply. When she does it, she does it with passion. That volcano has to burst in everything she does, be it work, be it cooking, be it taking care of your house, be it her children, be it you, be it her career. Her whole life is passion. That is fire. This fire burns inside of her. It's not easy to be the Scorpio woman, you know that. It's not easy to be her. 
because when she's alone, you know, and she has been betrayed, which she gets betrayed many a times in her life, then she becomes very bitter. And then she's in her loneliness, you know. She sheds tears. It's not very easy for her. She sheds tears. When she does a rewind of her life, and when she sees that she was just an honest, brutally loyal, devoted woman, does she deserve this? She asks herself. And then she rises up, like the phoenix rises up after being burned from the ashes. And she says, I will again do my life pretty well. She's hypersensitive, my dear. She's very, very sensitive lady. Even if she shows her individualism, you know, she has that. She has that fire which can burn absolutely anyone, okay? But she needs a stronger man than her. He has to be really strong. The man who wants to tame the Scorpio. And then she will tame you and make the best out of you. She will make you, she will really take you from ashes to glory. I can tell you that. She has that. She will love you fiercely. She needs to be your legal wife. She has to be married to you also. She doesn't like the second position in life. No, 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 no. She will never like the second position in life. And if it is very difficult for you to get married to her, my dear, then she will love you still. She will love you very fiercely. And she will not care a bit to what people are saying about your relationship. She doesn't care. When she loves you, she loves you. That's all. I mean, where will you find such fierce loyalty, tell me? Hmm? Of course, you have, in the bargain, you have to take a bit of those <laughs> stings that come time to time on you. But you don't have to worry about that. Because this loyalty of this woman is eternal. She will stay by you if you are worthy of her. She doesn't settle for men who are unworthy. No, no, no. She will never do that. At times, what happens is that the Scorpio woman, she has this perseverance in you, as I said, and this passion to excel in everything she does. She likes to be the winner. Okay, She, she really likes to be the winner. She cannot settle down for a second place. That's not her nature. Hmm? She has to be number one in everything and number one in your eyes especially. And sometimes what happens is that the Scorpio woman who goes through a lot of turmoil and a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of trauma that she goes through then she loses a bit of this confidence sometimes inside of her. She loses this uh, passion, you know, that fire goes a bit down. And at that time she can fall a trap to some kind of addictions. She can go to drugs in order to find herself. She, she wants to destroy herself after. She becomes self-destructive and in that she destroys her life many times. She doesn't understand at that time what she's doing, how much damage she's doing, not just for herself, but maybe if she has children for that also, just in that revenge, you know, what happens is that she destroys herself. She can go to drugs, she can go to drinks, she can, then, you know, she's like an uncontrollable storm. She becomes uncontrollable. Nobody can control her then. Nobody can control, only her, she herself. But she has to go through this because she's Scorpio, so she has to go through this dying, dying and dying. She has to go through this in order to resurrect from her weakness, whatever that she doesn't accept that weakness inside of her, she has to come up. That ego has to be controlled also in the Scorpio woman. My dear Scorpio women, I have to tell you, control that venom sometimes, okay? and uh, that ego also because that one you know like that person yes the person deserves that that person deserves a backlash on them but in that if you are 
steady in a couple if you have children then you have to think about them also that what are they facing because of your rigid behavior of not forgiving of just that revenge that i'm going to destroy that person in front of me because he did this to me they have done this to me you are right but every time doing that is not going to help my dear not for you not for your children not for your own peace of mind so there the scorpio woman has to really take care because if she controls herself on that there is no other strong woman on this earth than her that is what i feel that is supposed to you know that is a transformation a scorpio woman who tames herself she has to tame herself like they say that you can conquer everything and you are great but when you conquer yourself you are eternal so that is the message for you in this life my dear scorpio woman and yes the eyes of the scorpio woman is so 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 beautiful so hypnotic no matter what shape size color they are just look i mean the other day i was i was in the market and my of my friend her daughter is a scorpio you know oh 3 year old and i just you know when she looks at me like that i was like oh my god it's like you know really, you really feel hypnotized so deep deeper than the deepest sea i feel so so innocent that face is so innocent of that scorpio woman right from that childhood from that age sometimes i feel when we look into the scorpio baby's eyes you know when you are looking at them you will see look into the scorpio lady i mean uh, the little girl's eyes okay the baby girl's eyes and you will see as if she is understanding everything you know if she's a baby as if she knows what's happening play some music if it's a sad music the baby will start crying i'm telling you by experience just at the age of 6 or 7 months the baby starts crying only by listening to that i mean can you imagine this baby girl is already so developed inside of her so when she grows up into this scorpio woman she has accumulated a lot and lot of experiences and lot of wisdom and then she fails to understand why are you behaving like this why are you so clumsy why are you behaving like a kid have you seen your scorpio woman sometimes like when you're behaving very <laughs> like a kid you know doing all kind of stupid things and try to in front of her all those you know jumping around like a jumping jack you know she just watches you and she laughs you know she likes to laugh and she just laughs and she you know <laughs> what is this one up to you know she really expects you to be the gentleman you know she expects you to be respectable know that a scorpion for a scorpio woman she expects you to be very respectable because she is very dignified she is very respectable in her own ways she will be until and unless she wants to take revenge of you she will go to the other side oh then she can behave like a mess and mind you i am not going to come and rescue you from that mess huh? i have told you right now i cannot help you there I don't want to get anything on my face. No, no, I'm with her. I'm with her because I know why she's behaving like that. I will not even call on your behalf and get all the lava on my face. No, I don't want to do that. Who had asked you to do something that is going to make her upset? Who had asked you to go wrong? Know that the truth matters for this woman. And I as I said, she means business. don't approach her if you are just you know going for something very light and you know touch and go kind of stuff no 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 she is deep extremely deep this woman is and her <laughs> another thing is her jokes her her jokes can be quite sarcastic also she can make them on you Another thing you have to know about this Scorpio woman 
is that you can own her heart you can have place in her heart but she will never reveal to you everything that she is she stays an enigma the mysterious magnetic enigma that she is you cannot own her soul and you cannot own her mind no 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 that belongs to her maybe she is having uh, if you enter into a room okay and you uh, you just try to open her drawer you will hear her yelling close that that's mine you cannot touch it she's very very possessive she will not let you touch some things not at all the rest she can share but there are some things which belong only to her if her mother has given her something or her father had given her something that's a childhood memory she will treasure it in a pet particular small box which will always be with her and you will not know that what is in that box even if you are her partner until she decides to show it you cannot some things belong only to her you have to know that my dear if you are the scorpio partner only her you are no way allowed i'm sorry to say poor you but then she is like that she can just keep it for herself you don't own her soul and you don't own her mind mind you <laughs> okay she is very very possessive but she doesn't get possessed no 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 she doesn't like to get possessed by you know if you try to show your per like be possessive with her no she are not going to be very happy but she will be possessive about you that's her right to be possessive she feels and yes in order to keep you on the right track she has to be possessive and another thing about the scorpio woman is that um she <laughs> if you go with her you know if you're her partner and you're you know parting with her or something like that she attracts lots of attention on herself okay because she's very lovely with those lovely eyes and that she has that thing in her that magnetism that draws men to her not even a single man can escape that magnetic power of hers so she can attract lot of men towards her who can come and speak to her or you know even try to be a bit uh, a bit flirtatious with her also sometimes i mean she will never behave you know wrong she will she will be herself because you have to know that she is very honest and she is very brutal when it comes to speaking so she can put them right she doesn't need a man to defend her or tell her that don't do this or don't do that she knows it very well so you don't even fall into that trap of trying to tell her why are you speaking with this man or you know things like that but the partner of a scorpio woman i have seen many a times feels a bit uncomfortable by the attention that she gets and if he is a bit of on the ego side then mm, it can create some kind of ego hassles between them that she is more successful than him then he will feel a bit lower to her or you know this kind of uh, status fight uh, can start between this couple and then they can separate on those lines so if you are the partner of a scorpio woman you don't need to you know keep on doing like this like this door no no she's very independent she knows how to take care of herself and she knows how to put men right okay so you don't need to be very like this with her except if it's if your love for love and for affection you can do that to her but not in public don't try to do that be a bit protective but in a very uh you have to find a way i would say in a very uh, subtle way you will have to be protective about her but she will not she will not like it otherwise you have to know that about her also and you have to be strong because she will get attention and she will attract many people's eyes on her because she's a scorpio woman she just magnetic and all those iron pieces will get attracted to her tak 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 all the iron men <laughs> will get attracted to her immediately unless she chooses to repel them just like the magnet yeah at the end of the day i would say a scorpio woman to in order to conclude this video i would like to say scorpio woman has tremendous potential and she needs to know how much potential she has inside of her she has to just uh, leave aside uh, some 
self-destructive ways that uh, that hamper her from being really happy in her couple life and you know sometimes a bit of compromise is very much required doesn't you don't lose anything my dear Scorpio woman if you have to compromise a little bit not too much you don't need to do that but a little bit you know a little bit if it can save a, a marriage a relationship um, yes and a second chance a Scorpio woman never gives so I would like to request the Scorpio woman here watching this video is that consider a second chance if really you feel you know inside of you yeah, if really you feel that that person deserves a second chance uh, your your family can be uh, you know uh, patched up uh, just because of uh, you know one second chance that you give um, then you should definitely give it to that partner of yours or uh, that husband of yours my dear Scorpio woman and um, all I would like to say is stay your strong self you're very very strong woman and you can set examples for many women who are struggling with their lives and just I would like to say be soft on yourself don't be hard on yourself my dear yeah just be soft on yourself life is beautiful you are beautiful and I really feel you can be very hard on yourself so don't be hard on yourself just enjoy your life to the fullest so thank you my dear Scorpio woman <laughs> and all those who were watching uh, our Scorpio woman video thank you very much please do let me know how did you like it please do like share and comment and um, next time I'll see you with another video until then my dear Scorpio woman lots of love to you and uh, be that magnetic self always and that hypnotic self always. Bye-bye. <laughs> God bless. Lots of love. Bye. <laughs>